Hello, friends. Welcome back. All right. Um. Hold on. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna cheat. I thought about flying there. Oh, sorry, cheating. But I'm just taking the easy way there. I thought about flying, but it's like you know what? We're here. Let's just do this. All right. First up, we need to sleep. Because I'm a little beat up. Nope. Alright. And then I think... Oh wait, hold on. Okay, you're gonna have that. <laughs> I'm gonna have to remember to take a picture of that later. Because, um, I don't feel like running all the way down there. Oh, you know what I didn't look at? Okay, so there's a piece of heart in the Swift Solutions here. Which I think was something we already had, but we're completely empty now so we can get it. Now, I don't have to sneak, right? Yeah. We can just come in here. So, my question is, we came in here, and Swain started to go that way. Why? The room we wanted was this way. That's weird. Ooh, look at you. You're back in your actual, like, pretty outfit. Guess what? Your princeliness. We got all of them stones. You have more than Star's magic stones? So you've recovered the map from Kublai. That's right, your highness. Well, actually, he kind of gave it to us. The Bly helped you? The, the Sky Pirate? It's not a bad start. Once you get to know him, he took us under his wing, even. Or, like, even gave us a dragon to fly about on. Tidy, eh? He gave you a dragon? Can this be true? It's true, your highness. Tengri helped us find the three magic stones. We couldn't have done it without him. The problem now is how to stick the stones back into Mornstar. And I won't lie to you, we don't have the foggiest. We were kind of hoping you might be able to help us, Your Highness. Why are we still calling him Your Highness? Please give me the wand and the stones. I wish to examine them. Oh, really? You can't do voice acting? Hmm. This is rather... This is rather a tricky one. Oh, don't tell me you can't help us either. Stones are just too big, aren't they? Well, if it were a mere matter of unifying the size of the wand... Oh, excuse me. And <laughs> the stones, my power would more than suffice. But I'm afraid that it's not only their dimensions that are out of alignment. There is another problem, one that I lack the ability to resolve. Hang on a minute. Are you telling us it ain't just the wonky sizes we have to worry about? It's never flippant easy, is it? I think I got it. Just think for a moment. When exactly did we get hold of Mornstar? It was when we were sent back to the past, which means some... Problem may stem from attempting to join the Mornstar fifteen years past, with the stones you obtained here in the present. As long as there is this high difference, so to speak, it may not be possible to unite them. So we need to find the 
find Morningstar here in the present? Only were that simple. I had my men search for it, but it seems it has been destroyed. Not a trace of it remains in our time. Hold on. We brought it with us from the past, so surely it makes sense that it doesn't exist in the present oh, well, as well. Yeah. Wait. What? Hold on, hold on. It's all getting a bit too flippant complicated for me. Me too, Drippy. There may be one who can help you. I speak of Kulan? Of the four great sages, her magical powers were the most formidable. So if we can find the great sage Kulan, she can help us with Mornstar. We talk about Kulan. Why do I not like where this is going? Queen of the heavens, right? She ruled a city in the clouds called Zandu, Zanadu. But that place was destroyed, yes. Jeepers, her city was destroyed? Can't really be five years ago? Yes, it must be. Five years ago, news reached us that Shadar had attacked the celestial citadel of Xanadu. By the time we mustered our forces, it was too late. When Hamlet's airborne division arrived, Xanadu had been wiped from the map. I'm afraid I do not know what became of its queen and her subjects. Perhaps, if you are lucky. Ah, oh, fat chance. Sounds like Shadar dealt with them just like he dealt with your predecessor. Swain, please. In any case, it is not within my power to help you. For that, I can only apologize. Don't worry, Your Majesty. There must be another way. Well, if we can't fight a lot, I guess we just try another great sage. Another? Well, Alicia is no longer with us, which leaves only Rashad. Yes! My father is sure to know something. Wait, he... We did, did we not mention that before? Your father? Ah, now I see where you get your wisdom. Yes, Rashad may well be able to help you. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. <laughs> We're not going to find anything out by hanging around here, swapping compliments. Let's be off, shall we? Sure, let's go find somebody who can help us. They'll play somewhere. I just know they are. Alright, um... I can't travel from here? Uh, that's a first. Can I travel from here? I just noticed something. Why do Oliver's pants not reach? Well, I didn't just notice it, but I, I think... Uh, where is everybody? Okay, there are still people here. Whew. I was like, where'd the guards go? They're supposed to be here. Oh. Gosh, look at her. Uh... Why is she kind of see-through? That's not the type of armor you find around these parts. There's no s that's no snout, for starters. Hmm, there's sure something strange about her. Hold on, could she be... What is it, Swain? Is she a friend of yours? Yeah. We go way back, but seriously, is that armor she's wearing... It's what they wore in Xanadu. What? But I thought Xanadu was destroyed. I don't know if she's a survivor, because she's not going to little see-through. Uh, there's Lucky. Come on, Ollie boy. Let's find out what our girls have to say first. Yep. I could hope... One moment. Okay, sorry about that. Oh. There it is, spirit medium. Ooh. Can it be? Can you can you see me? Of course we can. Why wouldn't we be able to? Uh, Swain? I just use spirit medium. You might want to check what that spell does. Oh, this is marvelous. And you could hear me too. Sure we can hear you. But if we were using spirit medium to speak to you, it must mean you are correct. 
I lost my life some time ago. And you were the first to notice my presence. Well, we weren't going to miss you and not get up, were we? So you came from Xanadu, did you? Indeed. The celestial kingdom of Xanadu was my home. I was charged with protecting our queen. But Shadar destroyed Xanadu, didn't he? So I guess you... Um, no. I did not fall in battle. I... I was slain by a comrade. A fellow citizen of Xanadu. What? No. Oh, what do you mean? What you said was correct. Shadar did indeed lay waste to my home. The fiend made his way into the inner sanctum of the palace, unnoticed by anyone. Our magic had no effect on him. Even the mighty sorcery of Queen Kulan was useless. Kulan. But we heard she had the most powerful magic in all of the great sages. Of all the great sages. Woo! Nonetheless, it was of no use. She too was powerless against him. But Shadar did not take our lies. No, he robbed us of something else. He stole our hearts. He took the hearts of all who dwelled in our city. He stole all your hearts? Indeed, but without hearts to call our own, we lacked emotion. We lacked reason. And that was how it came to pass. But, oh, you've said enough. We can't imagine what happened then, believe me. Shadar will pay for this. What happened that day, I will never forget. Its horror is forever etched in my memory. That's so horrible. You killed one of your own people. I I'm so sorry. Do not pity me. My people still have hope. Hope? What do you mean? Queen Kulan, Queen of the Heavens. She lives still. Really? She does? But we thought that... Now that I dwell in the spirit realm, I can feel her presence. I can sense my queen's power. For years, I have searched for her without cease. But she is not to be found in this kingdom. I sense her presence somewhere to the north of here, but I sense something else too. An evil so terrible, I fear to approach it. North of here? Do you mean the Tombstone Trail? Hmm, maybe. Time what? It's... There were only a... There were other kingdoms on this continent. Now there's only Hamelin, in the odd town or two. But if she's out there, we have to find her. We've got Tengri. The Queen of Heavens is somewhere around here. We're sure to find her. Do you mean it? Do you really mean to search for her? You have my eternal gratitude. Don't worry, ma'am. We won't let Shadar get away with what he's done. Besides, we have our own score to, s to settle with the fiendish scoundrel. Oh, stop trying to impress her by sounding all heroic. What he means to say is leave it to us. I thank you most humbly. I am deeply grateful. Ah, oh, almost forgot. Did you find Queen Kalan or any other survivors of Xanadu? Would you give them this? It was damaged by the fire that swept through our realm, but it is the only remaining proof that my city, and indeed myself, ever existed. Sure, leave it to us. Oh. That's enough chit chat for now. It's time to scour Anamina and see if we can't find Queen Kalan. Okay. That explains why it wouldn't let me travel. Okay. Real quick. We're gonna run by... Uh... Swift Solutions. There we go. I remembered. Grab whatever the emotion is. And then we'll go outside and see if we can't figure out where the queen is. Hi.
Let's run outside. I think I'm only gonna say, actually, no, we're gonna do one thing real quick. Should probably actually go to, uh, By 17. I know that's going to like. Okay. So now, got a bunch of cheeseburgers. I've got. Some, some iced coffees, which I would love to turn into espressos, but I can't just yet. Okay. Oh. Just a second, I saw the glimmer. What? Oh, I talked to Drippy instead of. Oh, there's a hunt over the. Also, I like how you can't see Hamlin anymore. I'm a little, little hesitant. Oh, who goes there? Oh, I see you are not from these parts. How very observant you are of you. Oops. Listen, we'd love to stay in chat, but we got things to do. Instead of being blessed by a higher power, not a lot of likes you to stir tranquility in such a sacred place. Look at that animal. I want it. Gee, service her. We didn't know anything, but we're not here to disturb anything. Talk about a warm, flippant welcome. This miserable so-and-so could do with some lessons to hospitality, my dear old man. Cease your senseless witterings. I will not let you pass. Be gone. I have important matters to attend to. The sacred ceremony is about to begin, and Queen Gulan will not be kept waiting. Hold on. Did you say Queen Gulan? It's her we're after. Aha! Just as I thought. You intend to harm our queen. Well, you should not do so while I drop breath. No, you've got it all wrong, mister. We just want to speak with her. Somebody told us she was alive. This person gave us this medal. Why did we put the medal away? But, but how? Tell me, where did you find this? We met a lady in Hamlet. She was wearing armor just like yours. Can it be? Is she here now? No, she said she wouldn't travel north. I reckon she had enough on her plate already, what with her being dead and all. But this... Can it be true? You'd really be gone. Seems our friend here and that mystery woman have some history. I feared she had not escaped. But I cannot allow my feelings to come before my duty. Tell me, what business have you with the queen? There's something we need to ask her. I see. Well, I will let you pass. But I'm afraid you may be out of luck. What? You mean we can't see Queen Gulan? I fear she will have no time for you now. Do not say that she's preparing to preside over the sacred... Yeah, over the right sacred ceremony. Uh, for the time being, take a look around the town and see how it has blossomed since revive, receiving the blessing of the Queen of the Heavens.
Why are there snakes? Oh, excuse me. Oh, oh. Look at them! I want them! Oh! I want them! Lapaka? Is it a cross between a um, llama and an alpaca? Oh, did I see a glowing? I did see a glowing jar over here. Hello? The blessings of the queen cleanse our hearts. We have no more worries. No fear. Oh! Just realized what this is. We're going in here. Do I have an... I do not. Oh boy, you are expensive. Alright, quick question. What do you have for me? You have espressos. And strong coffee. You also have weapons. So that's good for three people. Look at that price, though. Oh, boy. Good for a couple people. Okay, so... Buy green grapes here. Nice to know. trigger that aha I see it there we go That's where I need to go, but... Oh, look at... Uh, I'm sorry, are you carrying a... Oh, I see that chest. Sorry. Snowdrop bonbons. Horus. Oh, it's you, Ollie. You must have spent a, time, a lot of time on your hands. No, actually, I flew up. Yep. Hardly. Like. One of the great things about being ghosted, I grew up pretty much anyway. Anyway, take a look at the words on the board here. Okay. Oh, uh, can't make heads tail that while you're writing. I suppose they do look like Nazcana? I never did figure out how to say that. Now that I think about it. Maybe not as stupid as you look, Crypt's Queen. They're actually based on the roots. Okay. Uh, okay. Reaches of the world, you find a bit of Nazcan here and there. A certain character that only appears in one location. My question is, where is it? Uh...
regions of the world. Uh, why are there red stars? Wait a minute. No, that's not right. Why are there red stars? Um... I'm looking. I'm not seeing Nazca anywhere. That's not quite what she looks like. Hey, look. It's my favorite place. Um. Well, you can tell this book uh, hasn't been updated in a while. So, why are there keyholes? And what looks like a mushroom forest? And look, there's a keyhole there. And three more. Oops, not what I was trying to do. Um. What? Okay. Try not to do this. Wait, is it here or is it on my phone? It's on my phone. Okay, hold on. Because quite honestly, I have no idea what I'm going to find here. Uh, let's see. No. Okay, it's in here. Let's see. Yep. Uh, that's Castaway Cove, right? Yep. Hamlin. Yule. Okay, here we go. Apparently, that's it. Ah, uh, uh, yep, she's right there. Okay, I was looking for like actual letters. All right. So. Nope. Hold on. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Makes it easier to spell when I have it in front of me, too. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, I didn't realize that. Um, uh, yeah, sure, we'll go with that. Mail, okay. Uh, can I ask you something? Do you know anything about the little island that has a monument with Nazcan writing on it? Off of the sea to the west, the fairground is. You know the one we meant. This is the fairground, hmm. Oh, I think there was a big battle there during the Wizard Wars. But I'm sure there used to be a much bigger island there. Where could this new one have sprung from? Well, Ma'am always told us fairies she made all the islands around there. Maybe she wants to talk it out of her hat for all. Really? So the fairy mom could do creation magic? Interesting. Eh, you really reckon she wasn't fibbing? Huh. There's more to my old man than meets the eye. Hold on a minute. How'd you know all this? Uh, good question. I don't remember. You sure do know an awful lot, horse. I bet there isn't a single thing you don't know about the wizard companion. Just what's your story, Bunt? How come you know all about the dim and distant past? I told you, Pip Sweet. I'm the sage of ages. It's not a flippant answer. That's all I can remember. I am Horace, the Sage of Ages. Beyond that, your guess is as good as mine. You really can't remember? I was certain that traveling the world would help bring back more of my memory. Now I'm not so sure. Sometimes I feel like it's all come back to me. But then it goes again, and I'm right back where I started. Ah, who cares? What matters is that I can go wherever I like and see whatever I please. Why well, fret about a little thing like losing my memory? I guess so. I mean, as long as you're sure you're happy. I like how your hair is great. Uh, I'll be fine. If I do remember something, you'll be the first to know. I'll be waiting back where we first met. Bye bye. Bye for now. Okay. Um, well. Real quick. We're gonna just double check that I don't. Okay. And I don't have the merit cards. Alright. And where's the errand board? Is this the errand board? That's the errand board. Okay. Um, so we have a few there, but we'll worry about it later. All right. So next time, do I have enough money? I have enough money to stay. All right. So next time we'll go sleep and probably actually push the story for it. All right. Farewell for now, friends.